Hi everyone, welcome and welcome back to another video tutorial. Alright, um, I'll be showing you how to create a background, simple steps and few other tricks here in CorelDRAW. Alright, um, it's very simple and very very easy to do. So without any further ado, let's begin. So um, I'll be making use of a square shape here. So you can use this background on flyers or any other kind of design that requires a background. So um, first of all, we'll double click. So um, it assumes the shape of the drawing page. So I'm um, P to fit to join P to fit to join page. So what to do next is uh, we select the artistic media tool here. Yeah? So we select this. So what this does is um, it add artistic brush, spray and calligraphy effects by using freehand strokes. So we'll draw um, a brush here. Yeah? So you can actually um, change the size and um, the angle or whatever. But I'm actually okay with this. So we'll just play around with this so this is not what I want okay let's try something more better so this is okay so we we'll duplicate this select make sure this is selected then you hold control then you drag right click then control R to repeat control R so this is okay then control G and P to fit to join page so um you have to first of all convert this to a bitmap so you convert to bitmap so you can actually apply some edit here so you go to effects under effect you go to distort under distort you go to ripple so this is what it does here so um you can apply some changes here so um, I'll be doing this until I'm satisfied with what I got. So um, let's keep applying some effect to this. So you can actually change the angle of this. You can actually distort the ripple, change the angle. So I'm actually okay with this. So you do this until you're satisfied with what you got. So once I'm done, you click on OK. So um, so you drag this, then you power clip into this frame created here. Power clip. So just to be sure, then P to fit to join page. So um, we've entered the power clip. So to exit the power clip, you can hold Control and you click. So you've exited the power clip. So now um, this is the form part of it. We we'll add some gradient to it. So remove the outline for this. So just right click this area, you remove the outline. So um we copy this gradient. This is a gradient that I created, so you just control C and come to this page, control V. So um you just you hold the right click button and you drag it over this, then you copy all properties. So um this is actually very fine. The background we've successfully created. So um, using the artistic media tool and um, the gradient of these colors, so, can't you see how beautiful this is? So um, actually reduce the opacity or the transparency. Let's see to your own satisfaction. Let's see 90, then enter. So um, this is actually very beautiful, depending on what you want. So um, guys, that is on how to create um, a background of your choice here in Corel Draw. So I just use the artistic media to here as an example. You can actually use whatever you feel that can achieve this effect. Depending on how creative you can be. So you just apply then follow some of the process I did here and you achieve something like this or even better. So this is where I use some of the designs. That's so it's very functional. So I this is the kind of um design I created with the background. So um so beautiful also this these are the designs i created with it within that um, background i created from scratch so guys it's very simple and very very easy to do all right guys if you found this video helpful do want to hit on the subscribe button turn on post notification bell to get notified whenever i upload new videos and don't forget to like share to your friends who might find this helpful and see you on the next video tutorial thank you for watching